Hey guys, this is Bastian from Team Droyo and today we are, it's the second day of Team 22 in Las Vegas. And for all of you that can't be here, unfortunately, in Vegas, we at least want to have some kind of a demo and show you and tell you what has been, um, what, the, about the latest stuff that happened in Team Droyo. So, um, as you all know, we are the go-to tool for visualization inside of Confluence, especially Confluence Cloud, of course. Um, and you know that we are strong in technical diagramming, but for Team 22, we now also provide digital whiteboards with, and this is the cool thing, real-time collaboration inside of Confluence Cloud. So this offers you both of both worlds. You have technical diagramming, you have digital whiteboards and real-time collaboration, but all inside one app. So it's not like you have to purchase a separate app to use digital whiteboards. It's all part of the Drawio app inside of Confluence. Um, so I'm going to demo it to you real quick. So what you see here, and this is uh, what you're familiar with, I just uh, show it to you. This is the classic diagrams net editor. Uh, in this case, it's a class diagram, and this is what you are familiar with. This is what we did in the past. But now this is our whiteboarding feature that I'm just going to edit here. And you see that the editor is significantly reduced. It just looks like a whiteboard. All the features that you know and love out of, from the diagrams editor are also available inside the whiteboard editor. But we do have a different set of default uh, settings. So for example, if we don't have a grid here. You can, oh, thanks, Colin. What you already see here is that Colin joined my page because everything that you have to do to collaborate with your team on whiteboards is just to hit right click on your canvas and share your mouse cursor. So from now on, you can collaborate on your board just like uh, you're, you're familiar from other whiteboarding tools. So what I do here is now I just create another custom shape. And Colin will also create a custom shape that you wasn't, weren't able to see because I didn't collapse my format panel. <laughs> but now I did that. And you see what Colin is doing there. Uh, you can, of course, uh, add some post-its here. You have a couple of different op options here. Even you can use freehand drawing. Uh, and now, sorry for my freehand drawing. I'm not that good at it. I do have better qualities, <laughs> but you can do so too. So stop drawing by that time. This is an object like all the other objects and you can move it around. You can even recolor it. So this is one option too. Um, you can have templates embedded in the whiteboard that you can use, for example, for meetings, uh, for retrospectives, if you're inside an Agile team. And everything that you do here will immediately be saved to your conference page, which is pretty cool. So you don't need any external tools any longer. And again, all part of the existing Drawio Diagrams for Confluence um, app inside of, uh, inside of Confluence Cloud. It's also available for Confluence Server and Data Center, um, but in Cloud we also have the real-time editing. So yeah, that's it. That's the latest stuff from Team Drawio. And if you're interested in uh, just getting a few details about the editor, just contact us. We have our contact information linked. And yeah, happy to talk to you about, uh, to talk to you and get your feedback. Thanks. Take care. Best wishes from Las Vegas.